Hey everybody, it's Chris Demetric here from the Dems World. Well, you know, I'm here in the shop and I'm ready to do a project. I was commissioned to make some uh, hotels and houses from an old Monopoly set. Now, back in the days when Monopoly sets were cool, they made the hotels and the houses out of wood. So my question to you is, should I just do blindly exactly as I was told with the dimensions that were given? Or should you use logic and look at the pictures and change what I was asked to make? So here's my quandary. They're saying these are what they want me to replicate in wood, which would be pretty straightforward. The larger hotel that's taller and a shorter greenhouse from Monopoly. The red hotels are three quarter inch long and a half inch high. The greenhouses are three quarter inch high and a half inch long. Well that wouldn't make sense because two thirds is larger than one half. So that would make the houses taller than the hotels. So should I do what I was instructed to or should I do with what I see here and replicate it? So I will contact that person see what they want me to do. But have you come across this where you've actually uh, we're told, hey, make it this way, and then you look and you're like, logically, it doesn't make sense, but you're doing exactly as you instructed, or should you stop, wait, and say, look, it, this doesn't make sense, let me contact this person. So, but anyways, I thought I would show you the steps I use to make these hotels. Well, I'm sure there's a lot of ways to do it. I just tilted the table saw to 45 degrees. I cut about halfway through, and then what I did is I flipped that over and cut another 45 so it would leave me with this pointed end. Now I can actually put the uh, 45s down, cut them for the height that I want the hotels to be first. Uh, once I've cut that out, I went ahead and just flipped over to the other side and cut the shorter ones down for the houses. So to make painting easier, I went ahead and painted everything in strips, the whole length of it first, and then I went and brought it over to the bandsaw and cut them down the hotels to the three quarter inch that it's meant to be. And then once I cut all of the little hotels out, I went ahead and just made it a little bit shorter and I sliced out all of the little uh, houses. So what you see here is just me finishing the painting on the ends and then I went through and spent a while sanding them all down. And of course what's project is not complete without some spray lacquer. And they're all done, ready to be sent off. I packaged them up in a couple Ziploc bags and now they're just like old new stock. Well thanks for watching, this is Chris from TDW Woodworks and see you on the flip side.